I was raised with three little burbies, like my younger siblings. And mm. man, I just want to say they know how to aim. <gasps> okay. <laughs> yeah. I've wanted to bring it, bring up this yeah. conversation for a long time. And I think this is the perfect time. Uh-huh. Yes. Haka, when you aim, where do you aim? I, I'm more of a silent PP man, so I don't mm -hmm. aim at the water. I aim at like the corner of, of <gasps> like, uh, like, like I, I aim at the division between the toilet, the dry area, and the wet area. You know the strat. Yeah, I know the strat. You gotta like go at, at a certain angle so that it doesn't exactly, splash much. Exactly, exactly. You know? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Or you gotta put some toilet paper. You get some toilet paper, you roll it down, you put mm -hmm. it there, and that's a cushion. I'll, I've never tried the toilet paper method, but I'll give it a try, sure. Okay, how about when you're at a urinal, though? Uh, I, I hate I, urinals. I, I, I like pizza to the side, you know? I, I, I like yeah, angle it downwards. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I get a little bit like, shy. Yeah, that, I get a little bit shy. That way it doesn't like splash back, you know? It's like perfect. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because I feel like urinals are more prone to make you splash. And then you got to do like the, like, you know, like the... It's disgusting, you, 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 you No, you wash your hands and then you tap your hands a little bit on, on, on your pants to like, you know, hide it, you know, the strategy in case you splash oh, yourself. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> The fact that you're so experienced in that, I'm, I'm worried, man. <laughs> <laughs> what is this conversation? This is just dudes being dudes. Don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah. What? You, you don't talk about this with your bros? Come on. Come on. Nah, yeah. Okay, can we switch up the board again? Can we reverse it again? No! Okay, which way to switch up the board? I will, I will, I will, like, twist How do I look at the map? off. I swear what? to God. I don't know. <laughs> you're gonna what? I will twist your dick off. I think you should go right, dude. Who's this? Fucking yeah, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna shoot what? you. I'm gonna teabag you. Kelly, if I can I say something that's like, the heart of go ahead. Uh, I, I could say it. I would rather cut my dick off and throw it into the cauldron. <laughs> Not interested. Maybe next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry if that's gonna get you in trouble, but it's right from the heart. Like, <laughs> You that's heard it here one. first. That's what he'd rather do. <laughs> Besties, that's what your Oshi would rather do. I'm kind of based. Do you want to know what's on it? Yes, please. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, first, can you tell me the color of the book? It's like book colored. Like, I don't know what, what, what like a normal page is colored. Like, tan? Over. Come in again? It's like a tan. Oh, the, bl the book, I guess, is blue. Thank you. We'll, go, we'll proceed with blue. The pages are tan. On the spectrum of blue to green, how blue is this blue book? It's like a blue-gray. Reference of a real-life object, place, or a thing? You know how blue the blue is. So it's like a blue-gray, like a, like a, like the color of like a, a fighter jet. Which blue-gray fighter jet? Is, they, do they have specific shades? Like, is that a standardized unit of measurement that'll... I'm just trying to think of things that are blue-gray. Actually, the most memorable thing I've done on my trip. This is gonna sound really weird. I got a haircut. Uh, like, I'm just gonna let you guys know a little bit more about me, right? I got a, I got a guy back at home. At a specific barber, that guy cuts my hair, nobody else. So like, at that shop, there's like multiple barbers. I don't let any of the other barbers like cut my hair because I am a paranoid and extreme introvert. And it's just like, I don't let people get that close to me. Like, I don't like, I actually like really dislike being touched. I don't like it. So I have to like, I have to like trust the person, like the guy that like, like if that guy gets hit by a piano, I'm just never going to get a haircut ever again. If that guy is just like walking down the street and he gets hit by a piano, like, I guess I could just never get haircuts ever again. But I didn't get a haircut for like over a month because I was with my family and then I came home. I didn't even get to sleep in my bed. I like packed and then I left, right? And then I've been here and it's just like, I need, I need a haircut. It's just like way too, it's, so I got a haircut. It's not a story, but this is like the situation that I was in. They were cutting my hair, they were cutting my hair. They couldn't communicate with me. And I was just like, yeah, just, just do whatever, right? And they were cutting my hair. And then like underneath the, the shroud, to prevent like hair from getting on my clothing. I had my hands ready to like whip up into my neck area if they tried to like garrote me, right? If they tried to like put piano wire over my throat and kill me, like I was ready to like whip my hand up, arm, and then block it the entire way through. But I didn't get murdered, obviously. Your barber will remember this betrayal. Like it's been like imprinted into my soul. The fact that like somebody that I did not know was like cutting my hair. Vesper, what are you? What is your mind? I honestly don't know. How's the cut? Is it good? Yo, okay, yeah. Barbers in Japan are like different. They're just like good. This mother clucker like pulled out like a ruler. It's like, whoa, <laughs> what? 
Like, they're, they're, like, really good at what they do. Holy crap, they're really good. Yeah? Try, try, try it, try yes, it. Sir. You'll never get the chest of the Echi Nechan, though, so. Uh, what can I say? Ooh. Dude, ooh. when am I gonna get to use my perms to, like, actually talk to one? Uh, oh, oh, thank God. Man, oh, you're gonna it. use your yeah, clout? We, we don't oh have perms for that, bro. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. Are you just gonna God. go to someone and be like, hey, baby, you heard of VTubers? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you heard of oh, Axel Serious? Oh my god, Axel, serious? No, you need you need He's to get so an high. item, Maggie. Hey, uh, what the anyway, have you have you heard of VTubers? <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, yeah, VTubers, they're awesome. Jerry, you bring my you bring a new mom back home. I'm not accepting her. Just saying. Oh, oh god. No. Wow. Oh my god. I don't trust you at all. Oh my gosh, what is happening here? I'm gonna say so I don't. 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 Your pathetic attempts at this will not sway me. I was at the store and I was looking at the freezer and uh, the store was kind of tiny. It had like narrow rows and I was like, you know, against uh, against one of the shelves looking at the freezer, looking at what they got. And uh, there's like, like, I guess some teenagers or something. They're wearing Vans. They're wearing sweater and they had Vans on. So you're either like a teenager in high school or you're like not doing too well. You know what I mean? You're wearing a zip up sweater and Vans. You're a teenager or you gotta get it together, man. But there, there are some kids, you know, they're obviously kids. And I'm there at the freezer and he comes by one of, the, one of those kids and he goes, excuse me, sir. And just the way he said it at me was like, you know, cause people say like, like, sir, like, yes, sir. Like, thank you very much, sir. But it wasn't like that. It was like very, like, just very addressing, not with any intention other than to like address me and be polite, you know, just like, excuse me, sir. He just like, he kind of waddled through, waddled by in front of me. And I mean, I've been served before, but like, but this time, just just because of the, it, it was the context of it. He, he was just like, you could tell he is not that, I don't know how to describe it. You could tell he's not that polite. And he was like, activating his like because sometimes you get called sir and it's just like by a, a cashier or a waitress and they're just like not even thinking but this kid was like you could tell he was like time to turn on my like polite brain to address this person like i need to address this like gentleman because i'm gonna squeeze by him so i need to activate the like sir and it was like excuse me sir it didn't help i had my arms crossed behind my back and i was leaning forward a little bit looking at the stuff in the freezer not fake nice like genuine nice but a very perfect purposeful you know and that's the thing like i said like it, it was like it was very true true you know i i had yeah i had my arms crossed behind my back and i was leaned forward looking inside the freezer and i just felt i felt attacked i don't know man i still i think I, I still got a few years in me i thought that earlier as well i had the same thought i got my uh i got my hair done been getting my hair done the same way for like years since i was a kid and i looked at myself in the mirror and i was like this is the last time i'm getting my hair done because at a certain point it's not about the hair being good like you could have a bomb ass cut and it could be all done up and permed or whatever it's gonna be but if you're if you're that age it's, it's it's worse with guys right it's worse with guys if you're a guy right and your hair is dyed and done up and you're over a certain threshold it just looks extra bad and at a point i was like i have to just accept and embrace and i was like i was doing it and i was like you know what this is the last time i'm doing this because i just i saw a picture of myself and i was like fuck you know you ever see a picture of yourself and you're like shit it's different because like you can have bad pictures and you know it's like oh that's a bad picture you know that's like a that's a very unflattering angle but if you're old enough in the chat if anyone is over the age of 12 in my chat, and you know exactly what I'm talking about, where you see a picture someone has taken of you. And it has to be a picture that you didn't take yourself. Someone, you're just like in the room or like you're out to eat and your friend snaps a pic and you look at it and you're, and it's just like, shit. I had that moment. And I was like, you know what? I, I, I can't get my hair done anymore because I'll look like that guy. You guys know exactly what I'm talking about. That guy. Look at that horse. What am I even going to do with this if I win it? I always want to go center mass, but that's just not the answer. Oh man, that Brian did not move. I don't know how I feel about that actually.
Uh, uh, I don't know about this one either. These are all really hard. Oh, that was something. Uh, that was, oh, oh. Uh, oh, okay. All right. Okay, okay. I feel good about this. Oh, is it stuck, dude? Is it getting stuck? Uh, what the f I feel like I've lost understanding. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> they're like this fucking guy. They're really figuring, they're, they're trying to make this foolproof right now. They're like, there's no way you can fuck this up, right? <laughs> oh, come on! I'm sorry! I'm so there's gotta be like paper taped up with arrows pointing at where he... <laughs> Please, just throw it in the basket! Throw it in the basket! I can't take it anymore! What do you mean poke it? Okay, which way? Do I go all the way to the right? Do I go all... Uh, yeah, woo! <laughs> we did it! Have you e ever eaten a core of an apple? I have. Including the little, like, stem? I've eaten an entire apple before. There's a very short, very stupid story behind it. I was not drunk, I was a child. So one time I went into a supermarket with my, with Jimmy, my younger brother, brother Jimmy. Yeah, THE Jimmy Noir, country music legend Jimmy Noir. We went into a supermarket and I went there specifically to buy sodas for the both of us, right? We walked over like from the house to the supermarket. I lost track of my younger brother. And then when I found him, he was just like eating an apple. And then I got the soda pops and I was like looking for him and I was like a little bit panicked, right? Because it's just like, you know, you don't want to, you don't want to be the one that like loses your younger sibling. And then, and then, you know, they got to file a police report. Maybe you go to jail. Maybe they execute you. You don't know, right? Like you're, so I found, I found my brother and he was like at the butcher area and he was like watching the butchers like do their job, right? And he was like eating an apple. And I was like, oh, there you are, Jimmy. Like what happened? What happened? He's like, oh, nothing. He's like. Where'd you get the apple? He's like, oh, over there. And he points towards the produce section and he's eating apples. Like, Jimmy, Jimmy, you have to buy the food before you eat it. Jimmy, you're going to get in trouble. And then Jimmy started crying because I think he was like four or five. Yeah, I think he was like four, four years old. And then I just, like, I just spoke from the heart and I was just like, you're going to get in trouble because you ate it before you bought it, Jimmy. You're going to get in trouble. And then Jimmy started crying. He was crying really hard because he thought that he was going to get in big trouble, right? So we went off to the side and I was like, stop crying, Jimmy. Stop crying. Shh. I'll make it better. I'll make it better. Okay. And he's like, okay. Okay. He's like, okay. All right, give me the apple. And he's like, okay. And then Jimmy gave me the apple and it was mostly eaten. <laughs> I ate the whole thing. I ate the core of the apples. No evidence. Did they find out? Nope, nope. Perfect crime, perfect crime. She <laughs> turned into straight up theft. Someone ate the sticker. <laughs> so that's the story of like why I ate like the apple core. Jimmy ate like the meat of the apple, the regular part of the apple. And then I ate the core just to destroy the evidence. We were always like pretty close. As, as siblings, like as brothers, right? When we were younger. But after that, he was like, hey, you want me to clean your room? It's like, yeah, yeah, sure. And then he would clean my room, right? For like a month, right? <laughs> because I think in his mind, like he was going to go to like jail. He was going to go to like fruit jail. And then like I took, I bit the bullet and like I ate it. And then I ate the core because <laughs> we're so stupid. But I do d distinctly remember that like the butcher was like, why is that little child crying in front of the I remember he was like side eyeing us because like my Jimmy just started crying in front of the butchers like <laughs> Find a mate. I'm okay. I'm good. I'm cool, man. No 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 chill chill chill. I'm submissive. I'm submissive! I'm submissive! Run! If only it was this simple, right? You just look up into the sky and you go, ah! and then your lover just like responds and then just like shouting. He just like shout in the sky. Yo, come on, man. That's a cougar. Ow! Yo, I, where's my freaking, where my wolves at, man? Whoa, 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 buddy, buddy. You like that? Yeah, you like that, don't you? I'm giving you this nice, nice smile, huh? Look at that. You want to sniff noses? Oh yeah, what are you, what are you going to do? I'm going for it. Positive. I'm rolling. 
Hit him with the roll. We're rolling. Yeah, what's up? Let's sleep. Come on, Pasca. I can't I can't carry this all by myself. Bite this one! No, this one over here! You're getting greedy, Pasca! Right here. Pasca. Pasca, babe. Over here. I'm carrying this team. It's fighting back, Pahaska! Yes! Go for the kill! Go for the- Eat! Yes! Well done! This wolf is impressed with your strength and hunting skills and is willing to be your mate! Give them a name! Eat! Machina X Furion. Eat! Wife! Wife, help! I got the neck! What are you doing over there? Yes, come! Come! I got the neck! We gotta work together. We need a little bit more synergy here. Machina X Furion. Consume and grow those pups. I'm gonna sleep. Let's sleep. Monday, murder. Tuesday, murder. This is literally my schedule. Sunday, beans. This is like my. This is if I had a UK schedule. But I gave very, very flippant advice. <laughs> like, somebody was like, Vesper, how do I get a girlfriend? And then I was like, ah, just like take a shower, brush your teeth. This <laughs> is just the stupidest response. <laughs> Cause what do you want from me? What do you want from me? Do you think- do you think I know? What do you want from me? There's no way that I could do that. So it's just like, I just gave like, the most flippant response. <laughs> and I regretted that. Brush your teeth, take a shower, be gainfully in employed, don't be an asshole. And then it's just like, there you go. <laughs> Vesper, how does one get a boyfriend? So first you get a- <laughs> Get a Vesper Noir branded baseball bat, right? Then you put a, a video game out in like an open patch of land, like a field. Just put a video game out in a field, right? And then when a boy comes in to get that video game, you just hit him over the head with it. Drag him home. And then now you got a boyfriend. No, 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 no. You don't use a 4090 Ti as bait. That's how you get a husband. <laughs> it's if the only, the only difference in the two is like the quality of bait. <laughs> Portal, uh, it's also a puzzle game, but the thing is, like, it's mostly single player. Portal 2, because there's two of us. Is there GLaDOS Kachinka? Uh, <laughs> there is, and yeah, I you'll you'll see it when you're older. <laughs> I wouldn't look it up. It's going to awake things inside you, and no, you're actually going to look it up right now, aren't you? Holy shit! Can't say I didn't warn him. <laughs> there was one with twin tails. Nice. Play on you, you. I need to be able to know that I can trust you. Nice. Okay. okay. <laughs> Did you do that on purpose? Baby. <laughs> Holy shit, Shinner, you're mean. So, the idea, I think, we're mm -hmm. supposed to hit these platforms and then jump through the portals, right? Mm -hmm. And the idea is that we come out from this side and then hit the button on that wall. What? Let's go to the other okay. side. How could you like that voice? No, which one? The one, the one I'm doing? And this one. No, I do not. Why not? It, it activates my fight or flight. Why is that, Haka? Because I want to kill you. <gasps> Whoa! Oh, I think I know why you don't like it. It's exactly what you accuse me of too, right? Yeah, you're a pervert. I'm not a pervert! <laughs> That's the only thing you've Wait, just- listen. <laughs> They, we, they, the, the, the chat has known us for a week now. Who's more of a pervert, me or Flayon? Be you! Honest. No, no, the chat will decide. I see someone said 100% innocent. That's see? That's me. Yeah. Super chat, plot heavy visual novels. You of all, everyone right? should know. Right, yeah. I, that's what I've been telling you. It's not about that. It's about the, the, the romance in it. I, I've been telling him the type of like novels he likes to read. I've gone into his room and it's not fun. It is fun! Uh, Anything after that is from romance only! That's the whole point! Uh-huh. That is! What's the point of- My actual monkey noise is more like- <laughs> So, I guess I was the monkey all along. There was one collab way back, and Tempest HQ was inside. A Discord call, technically the wrong one. But then, how do I say this? I get very shy and anxious, and needy. So, I saw Timbus E.T. boy sitting in there. I didn't know any schedule. And then, I just saw them sitting there and I was like, wait, I should go talk to them. And when I did that, I'm very awkward. So, I wasn't comfortable saying hi normally. So my first thought process was, quick, be weird, therefore they will just react to that. 
and not react to any like flaws you have. My first thought was to go and join the call. Very, very, very weird noises. And then I think I felt something. Because something was off when I joined that. I almost got it, but if I had said anything, death. Luckily, I got saved by Magnini. That's why I call him Magnini. Then he begged me to get out and not say anything. He saved my bacon. If I... <laughs> I'm concentrating. I'm concentrating. I'm sweating, dude. What the fuck was that? Was that a dog toy? I think it's Fleon. <laughs> what the f actual? F yeah, I think it's Fl Fleon. What in the actual fuck is that? Is it Fleon? It's a squish toy. Oh, of course it's Fleon. <laughs> Sorry, did it scare you? No. Yes. We're just... I, saw, I heard it earlier. I was like, I'm what like, is that? Was that another <laughs> achievement I got? I just. It's cute, is that, right? What yeah. What is that? Is that is that yours? Yeah, you like it? Do you have a dog? I hope so. No, I don't. No, no dog. Oh, no. I bought him because he's cute. <laughs> yeah, not gonna be interesting. You bought something and you had to like lie about what you were buying to make it less embarrassing. I'm trying to think of something like that. Yeah, poor novels. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're for my grandma. I had a biology book, dude, that had like the fattest like titties I've so ever seen. <laughs> Yes. And when I, yeah. when, when, dude, so dude, sorry, when, when, when I opened that, when I opened that book, I, I, I know exactly what you mean. Wait, does he not? What in the? F what are we is not wrong with this guy? What? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Are we streaming? Oh, what? On. Somebody asked me for a scary story, right? It's really short, and it was probably the scariest situation that I've been in. I got really, really drunk in a, at a at a convention, like a like a nerd convention, right? And then I woke up and I didn't know where I was. I didn't have I didn't have my cell phone. I didn't have my wallet or anything. And like I spent like multiple hours trying to like figure out like what to do, right? And then uh, I eventually found out that I was in a different state. <laughs> I woke up in a completely different place and then eventually like I was like talking at a shop and it's like oh you're here and it's like how did I end up in a different state did you check your organs I did they're all there did you wake up in Ohio no man if I woke up in Ohio I'd be like well I guess this is where I die yo I, I know what Riz is I know I found out what Riz means it's like charisma right like your sauce you're like your mojo that's what it means right dude and I was thinking of the Riddler. What about instead of the Riddler, it's the Rizzler. Huh? It, what did the Super Chat say? Howdy, Altair. Just woke up and had a dream where you tried to convince me that you could tie your shoes on your own, but you were taking far too long. In the end, I gave in and just tied them for you out of pity. Has it really come to the point where I need to prove to you that I can tie my shoes? Hey, chat. I need to do this. First, I, I've been told, you do this, cross, and then you cross again, you know, double knot, and then you cross again. You know? It's called the triple knot. That's what you gotta do. It's that easy. I don't know why you guys tell me I can't tie my shoes. It's that easy, okay? It's not that hard. I'm telling you guys. There's also another way that I learned how to tie my shoes too. Um, this way was kind of weird. It, it's like, I don't know why anybody would do that, but you would like cross your, cro cross it, right? And you hold it like this, and you twist, and then you tie it, right? It's not that hard, okay? What was your That's favorite good. bionicle? A few minutes later. And I'd, I'd build my bionicle, and I'd, it would take me like three hours. It would, take me, it would take me three hours, and I'd just take my bionicle and throw it against the wall. What? Dude. <laughs> What's it wrong just, with you? It would just explode. What? You know, you, you know what I would do? You know what I would do? What? I would tie a shoelace to it, tie it to the fan, and it was flying for me. You guys are crazy. I just played with mine like a normal freaking kid. I built it and I played with it. What's wrong with you? I may or may have not put one in the, in the microwave when I was little. What? As you do. I don't know. I, I would build it. I'm like, oh, it's so beautiful. you right? it was so much fun building it. So I didn't want to disassemble it. So the easiest and fastest way of doing it was just throwing it against yes, the wall. Yes, slam the crap out of it. Yeah. What? 
Oh, uh, have you seen? Oh, uh, I was just gonna say, have you seen sexy bionicles? Sexy what? bionicles? Oh hell people, yeah! People make sexy bionicles. Yeah, they got dumpies and, and stuff. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. dude. Excuse me. Don't ju don't judge, man. Well, I'm interested. I'm just I'm just. Ah, I think your interest. I see. Okay, all right. I want to I want to learn more. <laughs> well, learn more. Well, I have a website for you, brother. <laughs> yeah, it's called DeviantArt.